Sensible haircut. You like my shirt? You like my shirt? It's new. I just bought it. You like my new shirt? I like my new shirt. Welcome everybody to Undertale. As you, uh, as I told you before, I went around and gathered up the items in question. Also, I was told to actually put away my hot cat and keep my hot dog. Oh wait, I had a CT. Oh yeah, I put I bought a second CT. My bad. Wasn't thinking, but yes. To put away my hat hot cat and keep the hot dog so that I could actually get a thing from the other door. That one with the, the cat, they growled at the hot cat. So apparently there's a thing behind that door too. Ooh, room service. Got my CT, yes. You pour the CT under the door. Why would you do that? Huh? That's just the way I want it. Here's a tip. You got 99G. All right, apparently this guy wants to drink tea off the floor because he's disgusting, like this dude over here. Ooh, room service! You got my cinnamon bun? You flatten the cinnamon bun until it's paper thin and then you slide it under the door. Huh? That's just the way I want it! I'm the brother of the other idiot on the other side of that door! You got 90G. So apparently, um, I didn't- I was supposed to get health from taking that- that room, but I didn't. You hear shuffling. Seems like you could put something under the door. Put? You put a hot dog in front of the door. A white paw shoots out from under the door. It tries to pull the hot dog into its room, but it keeps pressing it down too hard, and the hot dog keeps spinning away. It's fi it finally succeeds. You hear the grinding of stone. A single hush puppy slides out from under the door. You got a hush puppy. Okay, what the hell is this? Hush Puppy heals 65 HP. This wonderful spell will stop a dog from casting magic. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, that. Okay. Um. For some odd reason, I have this now. Uh. Somebody, please tell me what that does. Somebody? Anybody? Anybody? Okay. Nobody? Nobody, I guess. So, let's take a look at this. Uh. Okay, I could use the hot dog. Yeah, I'll take the hot dog. Keep some health items on me. Uh, actually, I... You know what? Now that I think about it, I have enough healing items for now. So I'll put away the... The hot cat for now and keep the hot dog. And I will... Also call Papyrus. Also, wait, no, call Toriel for first. Nobody picked up. Aw, no goat mommy for me! Mm, careful! I've heard that hotel has a dog problem! Oh, no pets allowed, huh? I'm not talking about pets. Nah. What's the problem? The problem is dog. What's wrong with dogs? Not all dogs, just that one. Oh no. What's wrong with it? Everything! Oh no, not the annoying dog! The worst dog on the face of this goddamn game! I don't want it! I don't want to do it! Also, I was told to go- Hold on. I made some money, so why not save it, so... I was told to go up this way. Actually, go to the right-hand side. Well, hello! You two are different. And you're both kinda cute, actually. What the hell? Yeah, ch- Oh god. Hey, check it out! Yeah, check it out! Okay. So like- Oh! Oh, they're valley girls! Oh no! Oh no! Valley girls! So, like, what's up? I'm Brad- Oh, how do I do a bratty girl? I'm bratty, and this is my best friend, Caddy. Hi, I'm Caddy, and this is my best friend, Braddy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, what? Uh, it's about your wares. This stuff inside is, like, totally wicked expensive. But, like, this stuff we found is, like, totally wicked cheap. You should, like, totally wicked buy all of it. Totally wicked buy all of it. Um... I mean, like, where does anyone get guns or food or 
We found it in the garbage! It's good garbage. It's like really good garbage. What? She's doing the Nico thing. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell is going on here? What are you two? Why are you in this game? You fucking met in my head. Where do we get the garbage? Like the garbage store, duh. Waterfall mostly. I found a gun in a dumpster. Oh my God. What? You found a gun in the dumpster? Also, I see Braddy and Caddy. Way back here. Back there. There will be Brack, Braddy, Braddy and Caddy. Oh my god, like totally Metaton. Oh my god, Metaton. He's like my robot husband. He's my waifu husband. Actually, he's like my husband. I think we're like both going to marry him. We're both like already married to him. He just like doesn't know it yet. Oh god, that face. Um, yeah, so like Dr. Alfie's built Metaton, right? That's like what they told you. But like Metaton always acts like being built was his idea somehow. And even right after he was built, he acted like Alfie's was an old friend. But they're, like, not friends anymore. Yeah, unlike me and Braddy, best friends forever. Totally lumpy space princess. What? Oh my god, Metata. Oh, yeah, old? Okay, apparently that's old? Question mark? Like, the garbage store, duh. I don't know what is going on. Oh my god, Metaton, he's like my robot. Yeah, we've already heard this. Why did it say old? He just doesn't know it yet. About Alfie's, oh my god, Alfie's. She used to live in our street. She was like our a big sister. I mean, like, if your big sister takes you on trips to the dump. She showed us the coolest places to find trash. She was always collecting these weird cartoons. Then she became the royal scientist. Yeah, we haven't seen her in forever. Oh, you know what? Remember the um, remember the ca the container with a uh, an anime on it and it had desperate claw marks. Methinks, methinks that uh, that was Alfie's. That was definitely Alfie's. So Alfie's was always like thought Asgore is a super cutie. So, like, I'm pretty sure she made Metaton to, like, totally impress him. A robot with a soul. That's, like, super relevant to his hobbies. So, after seeing Metaton, Asgore asked her to do all this as science stuff for him. But nobody's, like, seen anything from her yet. Or her at all. She must, like, just stay in her lab all day. Like, live a little girl. Yeah, like us. We're in the garbage all the time. Oh my god, he's a total goober. He's a big fuzzy goofball. Like, I love that guy. He's like so nice. God, we're like so hyped for the destruction of humanity. Oh, such hype for, for death. Death hype. Death hype, everybody. Okay, let's see what you got to buy. Junk food heals 17 HP, has a big bite out of it, you. Empty gun. Bullets not included. Bullets not included, huh? Attack up when worn. Uh, probably to someone's house, lol. What? Mystery key. Talk. Hold on, hold on. Can I sell stuff to this? To you guys? Something about Caddy and Braddy talking. Ugh, meow meow. Yeah, meow. Uh, what is that sound effect? Please stop. Please stop. Thanks, but we like don't really need anything. Oh my god, can you go get us some glam burgers? We don't really need anything. Wait, I'll pay you 100 G if you get Metaton's autograph. Um, to autograph my bot. Um, I don't think I I I don't think you have a thousand G for one. And two, that is weird. Stop that. Okay, uh, buy some mystery. You should buy all our stuff. Probably this someone's house. I'll buy it. I bought the key. Braddy, we're gonna be rich. I'm total. I have totally too much money. 
totally too much money to, like, even deal with this baloney. Like, totally. I'm, like, stuck doing this voice because I've done it too much. Like, totally. Oh, make it stop. Oh, hello, you're new. You look very weird and angsty. Welcome to... Th M <clears throat> he looks like... He looks like a uh, teenager, so I gotta get him the teen... Well, the teenager voice. Welcome to MTT Brand Burger Emporium, home of the Glam Burger. Sparkle up your day, TM. Talk. I'm sorry, haha. <laughs> it's against the rules to talk to customers who haven't bought anything. Bye. Uh, Starfeet. Uh, the Glam Burger, legendary hero. Steak in the shape of Metaton's face. Uh, I'm gonna buy this cheapest thing because I don't have it. Thanks, E! Have a fab you full day! Holy fuck on a stick, that face! Holy shit, stop! Stop, stop! Stop with that face or I'm going to die! Literally die from. What? Why do you keep trying to talk to me? Oh god, he's looking. Oh god, that face. Why are you the weird face, dude? Your face just needs to stop! I'll get in trouble if you get chummy with- if I get chummy with the customers! Sorry. So I wanted to be <laughs> Oh god. No! <laughs> okay. Uh, this character is weird, but hilarious already, and I like him. So I'm guessing this is what I just bought. This looks like the glam burger, that's the steak. That's, uh, whatever the hand sandwich or whatever, but uh, I guess I got the fruit, fruit parfait or whatever. So I wanted to be an actor? Life advice. Take it from me, little buddy. I'm- Oh! <laughs> He's got a fucking cigarette suddenly. He's like fucking- Oh my god, this man, This character already. Who the fuck are you? You're driving me crazy. I'm getting on in me in here, so let me give you some advice, little buddy. You still got time! Don't live like me! I'm 19 years old and I've already wasted my entire life! <laughs> Listen, I like you, little buddy, so I'm gonna save you a lot of trouble. Never interact with attractive, attractive people unless you're the one of them. They're just gonna take advantage of you! Like that time those two chicks asked to sneak me some glam- them some glam burgers! And I, naive teenager that I was, said yes to them. Bad idea. Why does that face remind me of, um, uh, the uh, One Punch Man guy? Tell me your story. So I went out to the alley to see those little two ladies and, uh, you know, see what happened next. Hmm. Then my boss, uh, saw me and asked me what I was doing. Oh god, the face is back. I was so startled, the hamburgers in my pocket tumbled out onto the ground. Not wanting to lose face, I scrambled to pick them up, but as I was leaning over, the weight of my remaining hamburgers caused my pants to fall down! Oh, you you poor son of a bitch. Then the girls laughed at me. Everyone calls me Burger Pants now. Take it from me, little buddy! Ah! Everyone calls me Little Burger Pants now. Metaton. When I first came to Hotland, it was my dream to work with Metaton. Well, be careful what you wish for, little buddy. Why is Metaton bad? God, have you even looked around? This place is a labyrinth of bad choices. Every time we try to change it, something for the better, he vetoes it and says that's not how they do it on the surface. Oh, right. Humans are always eating hamburgers made of sick wings and glue. Why else is MTT bad? Why do people find him so attractive? He's literally just a freaking rectangle! That is a very good question. Why does anybody find a square so sexy? You know, one time, I bought one of those, uh, kits online to make yourself more rectangular. They don't work! Ah, God, that sounds horrible. Future? What future? Nothing down here ever changes. I'll probably be trapped on this stupid job forever. But wait, there's one thing that keeps me going. If Asgore gets just one more soul, we'll finally get out to the surface. There'll be a brand new world. There's got to be a second chance out there for me, for everyone. So stay strong, little buddy. When I when I make it big, you'll keep I'll keep you in mind. Oh god, he's 
This poor son of a bitch. Anytime, little buddy. Oh, you are a uh, you are a sad sack of sh uh, no, not shit. You're just a sad sack, aren't you? You're a saddy sad sack. Okay, I'm going to put away the star fate for now because I got enough stuff in my inventory. Tons of shit. All the shit. I have too much shit. There's no response. I didn't think so. I think I called them. Really? Me neither. My parents wish you go on vacation. Oh, I didn't. I haven't actually read what they said when I go in here. Okay, here we go. A hotel? Cool! I've never stayed in a fancy hotel. Really? Me neither. Papyrus, we should go on vacation sometime. Yeah, let's vacation to a hotel. Okay. What else you got? Well, maybe we should go someplace besides the hotel, too. Oh, I was being sarcastic. I would never take a vacation for any reason! Really? Well, maybe we should... I thought maybe he would say something else, but apparently not. So, what about in here? What would there... Do you have to say in here? Ring, ring! Whoa! A fancy restaurant! Who needs that? Your friends are great chefs! Well, maybe our cooking abilities aren't exactly perfect. Nah, they totally are. Eat up, punk. You hear spaghetti thwop against the receiver? Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh my god, why? Why? Why are you two? Isn't friendship delicious? Yes, yes it is. Yes, it is, especially when it comes from you, Papyrus, because you are the best skeleton that ever skellied his way into my heart. Did you enjoy your stay? What? Room key? No, we don't do that. If you leave your room, you'll have to pay again. 100 a room, interested? Do not. Don't let us know if... Do let us know if you change your mind. Have a spectacular day. Hey, spectacular. Cooler day. It's locked from the inside. Aw. Thanks a trillion. Thanks a million. We're two idiots. You hear shuffling. Seems like you could put something under the door. Put. But you didn't have anything appealing. I have a hush puppy, I guess. I don't know why. Okay. Um. Core. So uh, I'm off to the core, but I really don't think I have the time because all my time was just literally spent talking to a handful of fucking people. So apparently, I've already been doing bullshit for the last 20 minutes. Anyway, that means that this video is over for now. I am totally sorry. I'm I'm sorry that I didn't get any farther into this game, but it was funny and it was definitely worth doing. So I thank you guys for tuning in, and I will see you all next time. Bye! Ultraviolet.